What's up y'all, Preston Smiles here from Melbourne, Australia. Today's transmission. Desire is the starting point for all accomplishment. Passion persuades. Guys, get that. Kinda, kinda passion, kinda desire creates kinda results. Get that, small fires create small heat because passion persuades. Now, how many of you guys have ever had a scenario or a situation where you knew clearly that somebody was trying to sell something to you and you had a no written all over you, but by the end of the conversation, you ended up saying yes. You ended up with a vacuum and you didn't even have a house. You ended up saying yes and parents, get this one, because I've been the kid on the other side of this one. How many of you parents have ever decided as a couple or however it is that it's a no? That Tommy or Jesse or Susan or whatever her name is cannot go to that party because it's going to be boys there and they're going to be drinking and all of these situations. And by the end of the conversation, they flash that, but mom, but dad, everyone's going to be there and I'm going to be the only one. And all of that passion turned your no into a yes. Passion persuades, guys. The, the, our, our attitude alters our ability. Our attitude alters our ability. We've all seen it in sports. We've seen it with a mother who can pick up a car because she's leveraged herself. She's changed her attitude, her state in a moment and went to lift up a car for her baby girl. We've seen it with the Michael Jordans and the Messies and the, and the Steph Currys and the, and the football players and all of these people who get on, on fire and they can't miss. They're scoring nonstop because their attitude alters their ability. The question is, is can you leverage yourself? Can you create an attitude, and an inner state of a fire? Can you let it burn within you before you go into work? Can you let it burn within you before you do that speech? Can you let it burn within you before you go into that bedroom with your woman or with your man? Because if you can leverage yourself, your attitude will alter your ability. Your ability will change based on your enthusiasm, your excitement, and your attitude. Guys, passion persuades your desire. Your desire can change the whole game. Your enthusiasm can change the whole game when you get into that space. People are drawn to you. They are enrolled by you. Whether you are speaking directly to them or not, when you light yourself on fire and move from being a small little kitchen fire to a forest fire, burning down all of those limiting beliefs and silly little conversations we have about how we're not enough, when you burn those things down and turn yourself into an internal flame, you, you draw people to you. The problem with most of us is that we've, we've gotten so educated, we've gotten so deep in our heads that, that, we, that we've lost track of our hearts. We've lost track of the thing, that, that, that internal GPS system. And we take jobs that we don't like because they're convenient and we end up with golden handcuffs and never leave for 10, 20, 30 years and we become uh, disgruntled human beings living in the world and then having kids and teaching them. We get into relationships out of fear, out of fear. And then we look up and the divorce rate is higher than it's ever been all over the planet. Guys, we gotta wake up and move back into the heart with our desire, with our passion. We must be consumed by things. Go too far, guys, go too far. The, one of the biggest things and the challenges that I see all the time is that people get caught up in the idea of balance. Go too far, you wanna be like a kid. You wanna pour yourself into things. Pour yourself into things and go too far and see what happens. Excitement, passion, and enthusiasm can achieve in one day what it takes reason and overthinking years. Change your attitude, change your life. Move into the state and, and, and operate from what burns in your heart. If you don't have uh, necessarily a, a giant purpose, just do what makes your heart smile for now and it'll, it'll find you, I promise you. Be consumed, guys. Be consumed. <sighs> Thank you for taking this journey with me. If you are new to my channel, new to the Preston Smiles Loves Voice family, I ask that you click subscribe if you're on YouTube, hit that red button below. If you're on Facebook or YouTube, I ask that you share this message. If you think somebody else in your family, your tribe, your crew would appreciate this message. 
Guys, I love you so much. Blessings and blessings from Melbourne, Australia. I am, we are, hashtag love's voice is going down in a beautiful major way. Live love, give love, be love. Oh, were created in the image and likeness of God. That can never fail. You are pure magic, pure beauty, and you're so powerful that you're creating even when you don't know you are.